Um, I think it's such a huge dynamic, right? That we are, that just me and you are sitting together because we, ha we are different in so many ways. And I think that sets sort of a... You mean you're not a redhead? No. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm a dreadhead. No. <laughs> dreadhead and redhead works for me. But um, yeah, it's just like, you know, because I think it sets the plateau for a lot of our congregation too, to, for, you know, as the church, mm -hmm. to sit down with people that they're different with. I mean, we, we, we serve, of course, right. we worship right. uh, together. And, and of course, we have the growth groups. Right. Um, um, but, it, you know, just to sit down with people we're different with also would give us the ability to understand, um, understand a better way to communicate. Yeah. And if you give uh, if you have a better way to communicate, that's the, the pathway into our ministry. Mm -hmm. And um, so I think that is very, um, very important. And, you know, I just want to know a little bit and how we can sort of, I mean, truly encourage, you know, more um, things such like such as this or yeah. uh, you know one of the wonderful gifts that God has given us at ACAC is mm -hmm. our diversity right because I'm convinced mm -hmm. what you see when you read the Word of God mm -hmm. is largely shaped by where you're standing mm -hmm. your life circumstance mm -hmm. and by the people you know right now, most of us tend to gravitate towards people who are just like us. Right. We don't get up in the morning and say, I'm only going to hang with people just like me. Mm -hmm. But we naturally sort of gravitate toward people like us mm -hmm. because we don't have to think as much. <laughs> and, and, and it's easier mm -hmm. and it's mm -hmm. more comfortable. Mm -hmm. And we look at somebody who different gender, different life experience, different ethnicity, different mm -hmm. economy, different politics, whatever. Mm -hmm. And I think we get a little bit intimidated, like, what if they ask me something that I'm awkward with? Or uh, what if I say something that's inappropriate or mm -hmm. whatever? So we tend to fall into these traps of sameness. Mm -hmm. And the result of that is we get this very narrow view of God, who he is, what he's up to, what the church is, what our mission in the world is all about. We just get this very narrow view because we have these blinders of sameness. Mm. At ACAC, God has given us wonderful opportunity mm -hmm. yes. to step across what tragically are often ethnic divisions, economic divisions, gender divisions, political divisions, mm -hmm. and to hear other people's perspective, mm -hmm. and to hear other people's stories. Mm -hmm. And every time we do that, we're going to learn more about God. Yes. We're going to learn more about ourselves. Mm -hmm. We're going to learn more about what it means to be the church. Right. And we're going to be equipped to have expanded influence, influence. Mm -hmm. we'll be able to influence people different than us not just people exactly like us right so all of that to say this people can contribute to expanded influence simply by moving from one spot in the church lobby mm -hmm five or six feet in the direction of somebody they don't know, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. who in some way is different than them, right. and saying, hi, I'm Rock, who are right. you? <laughs> right, and right. tell me a little something about yourself. Right, right. And people are eager to tell you a little something about themselves. Right, right. Mm -hmm. And then they'll invite you to tell you them a little something about yourself. Mm -hmm. Now, a relationship is started. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. one of the keys to a strong church is relationships. Mm -hmm. Relationships protect us, I feel, from stereotyping people. Mm -hmm. All of them think this way. That's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Relationships sensitize us mm -hmm. to needs that otherwise we might just blow right by. Mm -hmm relationships give us a better grasp 
-hmm. of the diversity of God's church and the heart of God. Mm -hmm. Relationships enable us to give more thorough answers to the inquiries of people. Mm -hmm. So, and those are just a few things. Relationships do a whole lot of good things.